Welcome back to Forte Sports. Make sure you like and subscribe to the channel. Stan Van Gundy was spitting some facts on Twitter and he was talking about today's NBA and how guys are just missing games. And I was actually did a video about the Clippers with Kawhi Leonard and Paul George and even John Wall. How they're not playing in back to back games. And it's just it's more players doing that. And Stan Van Gundy, man, he was he was talking, he was making a lot of sense. You mad Kevin the Rat saying he was spitting some facts and he was basically talking about nineties NBA players, how it's different and where they say today has better medicine. We've heard people saying it's better medicine and technology in today's NBA, but we're still seeing guys missing games, not playing. Some of them are healthy and not playing. I mean, I'm, I remember last year when we was talking about Ben Simmons and John Wall, they were not playing at all and they were healthy. So I, I agree with Stan Van Gundy 100% of what, what he was saying. Some, some guy did comment saying the game has changed and he hit him right back. Are we talking about physicality? Because the physicality was rougher in the 90s. You know, you could hand check, you could do all that stuff in the 90s. Even in the uh, early 2000s when Shaq was bowing the Kimbe Mutombo and stuff like that. The physicality was th then was rougher than what it is now. We even heard Luka and Giannis, both of them saying the NBA is easy compared to Euro basketball. So, yeah, man, he was, he was right on the money with all this stuff. And we've even had conversations. I remember it was conversations about... Um, making the NBA season shorter. And I was like, why? What's the purpose of that? These guys need to need to play 82 games. You know, stop babying them. That's that's something that I agree with staying on the, on that stuff. They're, these guys are being coddled. And yeah, they're making all this money, but yes, you're supposed to you, you're supposed to fulfill your contract. If these guys are able to play, let them play. Let them play. But it seems like this is going to continue. May get worse. It may get worse. They may cut down the NBA season, but it's possible if they're if they're um just if they're letting the Clippers do this type of stuff, and other teams are doing it too, where they could just tell the guy to sit it out. Because I, mean, I can't just say it's the players, the organizations. They play a part in this too. You know, we we could sit. We can sit here and say it's just the players. The organization is letting some of these players do. I'm not saying every organization is doing that, but some of them are just letting these players do this crap. And it's ridiculous. It's very ridiculous. So kudos to Stan Van Gundy coming out saying something like this. And the same for Kendrick Perkins. And uh, he was talking about it too with uh, Jalen Rose on, uh, what was it, on uh, NBA Today. So I give, give props to uh, Kendrick Perkins too on this stuff because it's, it's some soft soft um, stuff going on right now in today's NBA and I don't like it either but post comments let me know what you guys thoughts on Stan Van Gundy you know calling out the NBA today um, today's players make sure you subscribe to the channel